Hello, and welcome to ETCV 538, Mobile Technologies for Learning. My name is Chris Johnson, and I'm your instructor for this course. First off, three ways to get in touch with me. First is through my email, cgj at arizona.edu. Arizona I'm getting used to that. It used to be email.arizona.edu, but we recently changed to where you can just do arizona.edu. Also, please make sure it's a J and not an I. A lot of times people will see my email in an email and think it's an I. It's actually a J. The second way is to call or text me. Um, to be honest, I have my phone set to ignore numbers that I don't know, so you'll automatically go to vo uh, voicemail if you call me. However, if you text me, you'll get a more immediate response. But the best way to get me is to DM me through Slack. I do have notifications turned on, so whenever you um, send something to Slack, I get it automatically. So let's take a look at the course. How can you design them? How can you use principles such as universal design for learning? So we'll get into all of that as you go through some readings and watch some videos. We'll do some discussions in our weekly meetings on these topics. But the main focus of the course is for you to actually develop a mobile application prototype. And we'll be doing this using a tool called Adobe XD. You have access to Adobe XD through Creative Cloud. Instructions are in the course, but if you have problems, let me know. So your first assignment is to post an introduction in Slack. And also, please make sure that you see all of these Slack channels. If you're new to Slack and haven't signed up yet, once you do, direct message me and I will add you to them. You won't see them until I add you. Also, make sure, as I said, that you do see all of them because every once in a while when I'm adding somebody, I may miss a channel. So just make sure that you have all of these channels. And this will be in my welcoming email as well. Next. Be cognizant of the due dates. This course is going to be a little bit different than if others that you might have taken from me or from other instructors in that several of the modules have multiple assignments due at the end of the module. So you'll find the assignment due dates in the syllabi under the course schedule. You'll also find it in the course calendar and in the modules themselves. So in the first module, we're going to look at the promise and pitfalls of mobile learning. During the first three modules, you are going to be developing an annotated bibliography on a topic of your choice. You'll submit the first three annotations in this first module. You're going to submit the Slack so that you can look at others folks and comment on theirs. In module two, we'll look at making the most of mobile learning. You'll do your second of three annotations to Slack and you'll do a description of your mobile app to assignments. Now, if you have difficulty coming up with a topic, feel free to reach out to me. We can have a Zoom meeting and I'll be happy to brainstorm an app with you. In Module 4, we'll look at playing in virtual worlds, the idea of virtual reality video games, and their value. You'll submit your final bibliography and a grade justification. So you're going to take a look at the rubric and you're going to tell me why you think you should get the, a good grade. You'll do a mobile application mock-up and you'll post that to Slack. This mock-up can be using any media. It can be on paper. It could be a PowerPoint. If it's on paper, you're going to have to take pictures of it so that you can post it to Slack, but you can use whatever medium you want to. In Module 5, we'll look at some concepts of universal design and also the digital divide. In this module, you'll do an initial draft of your mobile application, and this will be in Adobe XD. So it'll be kind of a wireframe sort of thing with a couple of the, the screens done, five of them, but it will not be the complete application. 
That will come in module six, where we'll talk about some future directions and research in mobile learning, and you'll submit your final application. In the last module, do the last day of class, I'll ask you to do a reflection on your mobile application, and then also just kind of an overall reflection on the entire class. So I look forward to working with you all to see what you come up with, with your mobile applications. And remember, especially when you're getting into working with XD, I'm available at any time to meet with you through Zoom. We'll come up with a mutually agreeable time. If you need any help brainstorming, you have any questions, post them in Slack. If I can't answer them there, we'll do a Zoom meeting. So good luck, everyone.